Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for all the latest news and updates. Hello, you have logged into One India News YouTube channel and this is Mariam. Firstly, let us congratulate Congress Vice President Rahul Gandhi for an honest and candid address at the famous University of California in the United States on Tuesday. It is extremely rare to see Rahul at his oratory best and the Congress must be heaving a sigh of relief now, given that communication is probably Rahul Gandhi's weak point. Now it is another matter that Rahul decided to break his silence on a foreign shore. Rahul's address, India at 70, reflections on the path forward, which saw a large participation by young students focused on current issues concerning India, which included demonetization, goods and services tax and the politics of polarization, to name a few. Rahul's speech was given a huge thumbs up by none other than the Congress leader Shashi Tharoor, who anyway has the gift of the gap. Shashi Tharoor was present in the audience during Rahul's speech and he tweeted, a speech marked by equity and passion and a discussion infused with candor and insight. On expected lines, the ruling Bharatiya Janata Party slammed Rahul Gandhi for his speech. BJP spokesperson Sambit Patra called the Congress BP deplorable for slamming his own country while abroad. Sambit Patra added that Rahul's comments showed his frustration and said that he was extremely astonished by them. Well, Rahul Gandhi is pretty legendary for his goof-ups in public spaces, but today he showed us a rare sight of himself as a foreign soil where, in spite of making scathing attacks on PM Modi, which is probably Rahul Gandhi's favourite topic, he admitted without mincing any words that the Prime Minister was a much better communicator than him. Yes, Rahul Gandhi said, Mr. Modi has certain skills. He is a very good communicator, much better than me. He knows how to give a message to three to four different groups in a crowd, so his messaging ability is very effective and subtle. Well, it is rare to see the Congress Vice President complimenting Mr. Modi, and this time that he did, it indeed is a big news. That's all for now. For more news and updates, please subscribe to One India News YouTube channel.